Oh, we're going. Yeah. Right. We're hot. Hello, happy Sunday. Tomorrow's Monday. Back to work. Another five days. Another dime, another nickel. Another day, another dime. Make a lot of taxes. Something like that. Starting off good on this one. <laughs> uh, hello, happy su uh, Sunday. Welcome back to Silver Wolf Creations. Because this will be on YouTube first. It will be posted on Facebook on our site. And on uh, Silver Wolf Stitching and Vinyl. Which is our uh, Facebook site. So of course when this is over. Like the video share the video and uh, on YouTube like it hit the like button share it in comments keep the comments coming because it keeps it up there so everybody can see it got to get everybody in the world to see these posts sound good? All right, sounds good uh, so we're gonna give you an update on what we're doing what our status is how many what we have done and haven't done uh, I'll start off by showing you my two first cups. These two cups are uh, done. They're cleaned up. I'm gonna get them packaged in the 32 ounce hog tumblers. These are really good tumblers. Uh, EPA approved, 32 ounce. These one, these ones are. They keep your hot drinks hot for like 18 hours. Uh, your cold drinks for 24 hours. Um, they have the flip top lids you can put a straw in or you can just drink it normal very very secure very good lids uh, they go on these cups to screw on which I like I don't like the pop on ones if you like those well bummer not what I have for you I like the screw on lids screw them up nice and firm fitting very good. So this is my first cup. It's uh, Midnight Black. It's got a name with a badge number for somebody that works somewhere. It's uh, done for a very good friend. That was done. They get packaged back up. We do uh, we do do shipping. Shipping on these all the way from simply California or all the way to Florida even New York it'll be about 15 bucks it's for a two day uh, two day priority shipping right it's called priority, priority, two day priority shipping and insured uh, we do PayPal and the good old fashioned stuff cash and shipping so like I said These are my two first cups completed. This one is also for a good friend. It's actually for a husband and a wife thing. Silver line stripe, the name, and then the old, uh, what we used to call the Folgers Adams key. Southern style Folgers Adams key. One of this on his cup. Very simple, very simple cup. Beautiful black, silver line, and his name, and ring. So that's that. Uh, some of these cups start out very simple. This is how they start out. Silver. Nothing on them whatsoever. And then I make art. Beautiful, beautiful art. So that's nothing. That's a cup that's been prepped with nothing on it. Well, that's not a, well, it's been sanded. The first stage of the prepping. Then I spray paint them black or white, usually matte. This cup is prepped up to have something similar to this put on there. Something very similar to that put on there. It's going to be on the cup. Uh, something like that. Then I've got another cup. It's going to have some alcohol inks. It's going to have this on there. That's actually pretty cool. It's not going to have this one on there because there's a couple of mess ups on there. So this one I'm just keeping aside. Kind of for me. So this cup's ready to go, all prepped up, ready to go. I've got two Negan bats, Lucille bats, uh, turning. I've got a um, 
regular wood wood green style cup with somebody's uh, logo on it. You got a Batman cup, Pitbull Mama cup, the then my cup. I finally, after how long have I been doing this for? About oh, I don't know, two months. Finally made my cup. Go ahead and turn on the light for a second. This one is actually still curing. So this is my cup. Finally getting it going. I'm still in the process of this one. That's a pretty, it's a pretty cool cup. It's got uh, memories. Nine, nine years worth of memories mm -hmm. on this cup. Special cup. So as you see, this one is wood grain style. I can put pictures in there. And this was my first time trying uh, patches. These are actual unit patches. Trying that. Uh, I like it. It's interesting, I like it. So that's that. So as you can see, I can make special patches with the uh, I need special cups with uh, patches in them, possibly. Wanted to try a coin, but haven't tried that yet. Here's my Batman cup. This one's pretty cool. Is it on there, picture good? Batman cup, midnight blue. Black silhouette, city. Batman, he's got his name in there. And of course, my logo on the bottom. Then we got. Oh! Well, <laughs> oh. oh. horse shit. Oops. I'm balanced. <laughs> I'll be back in the picture in a minute. <laughs> Gravity. It's a hell of a thing. <laughs> what are you whispering? Yeah, I know. Bam, here's the next one. Purple. Purple cup. No, water bottle. I mean water bottle. <laughs> so it's a purple water bottle with a pit bull on there. And then I'm going to take this is uh, pr uh, prism, prism, prism. Not on. And I'm gonna put that on there. We'll see how it looks. I don't know how that's gonna blend in with this, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Actually, why don't you tilt the camera down here a little bit, and we'll do it right now, really quick. Can you see everything? Oh, uh, may have to get another position. Hold on. Oh, oh. Hold it up. How's that? There you go. Well, I don't know. You can see it, not me. Uh, Here. I can't see it. There. You can't see it. Look through the camera. Hey, you're this way. Huh? Oh, oh. Okay, so you can see everything? Now to focus for a second, it should build up. How does this happen? Oh, there we go. Can you see it now? No, yeah, the cup's out of focus. How do you fix that? Oh, wait, there it goes. All right, you good? I think so. <laughs> I'm go to this end and see if we can look them up. <sighs> well, I'm actually blinded, so I can't, I can't oh. see. So we try to. Oh, that might actually help. So I'm gonna lift this up and get a start on. There we go. Tell you the truth, 
having that light on, I can't even see if I'm lifting them up or not. So I think we're going to probably do, well, I think it's lifting. I'll give it a shot. Give me a second. Seems to be coming up now. told you at the beginning when I would do these I would never choreograph these or have them pre uh, meditated as to what I was going to do I think today proved that and you're probably sitting there going boy I hope he hurries up either that or I'm going to just simply get off until later don't get off because I'm almost done I think I'm starting to be able to see the vinyl actually now Mama's over there. I think uh, uh, shaking her head at me for what you guys didn't see on the camera. Probably good. Probably a good thing. No, don't worry, no cups were harmed in the filming of this video. Just, uh, <laughs> just my pride for not having something some set up some way that wouldn't fall, basically. All right, here we go. Boy, that was our doors. Alright, so I'm gonna lay this in here. Can you see it okay? Oops. Oh, uh oh. Can you see it okay, Ma? Yeah. Alright. Uh -huh. Now we're gonna see how this vinyl looks against here. Now let me see some light for a second. This off. Hopefully, I don't pull. All right. Actually, that doesn't look too bad. So we got that on there, and then I'll do another layer of epoxy over this, so that that will always, forever, be good, and it won't. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> and it won't ever come up. Luckily, there's another layer of epoxy going on, so that, uh, you okay? Yeah, she was chewing plastic again. <laughs> so that's that one. Yeah, what have I got left? I showed you a Batman. I know how to put this on there so everything doesn't tip over again. All right. Now I'm going to show you the two Lucille bats. Let me see it when you. All right. All right, so here's the, another Lucille bat uh, cup. Matted hair, flash. It's got a uh, got this coat going on it, and then after this coat, I will cut like the hair there. Whoops, can't touch that. Cut the hair there, sand it down. And then get the next uh, layer going after that. John is dead. This uh, an old friend of mine's. That's all he wanted on this cup. Very simple. Special cup for him. He is uh, up in Oregon. We got that one. And then bam. Here's the other Lucille cup. It's in the beginning stages. 
This one's got a different gauge wire. Um, my flesh and intestines and hair, scalp. Big piece of scalp on that one. Alright. Alright, here's the camera. Go ahead and turn that. Alright. So that's this week's progress. With my leftover epoxy, usually I'll put it in the molds and make some stuff. Made that one yesterday. Mama got this one all the way from China. We boiled the mold so that the COVID-19 wouldn't come into this household and kill us all. Mariah didn't find that very amusing. She's not very happy about this COVID deal. Where's your uh, your mask, your Harry Potter mask? Is that in the car? Mm -hmm. That's a bummer. Mariah got a Harry Potter mask. It's pretty cool, actually. Uh, one side's got Harry Potter and the other side's got uh, Crest. The Ho Crest. Uh, Hogwarts Crest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, made a grenade. It's pretty cool. And then, of course, you got all these little. I have no clue what we're going to make with them, but. I'll show those. Probably put the light on for a second if you want. But when I have leftover epoxy. I put them into the molds and make these, these. I have no clue what I'm going to do with them yet. But like I said, I'm not going to just throw the, the stuff out. So we got those, and then we got the skulls. Some skulls are solid color. Some have uh, glitter in them. Some... I have glow in the dark mica in it. So, those are pretty neat. I got a tiny little teddy bear in this one right now. Probably pull it out a little bit, or I don't know. Yeah, pull it out a little bit. So, actually, it's coming out of the mold. And it's a cute little teddy bear. <laughs> There you have it. Uh, that's the update for this weekend. Probably a little bit boring, or maybe it was amusing as heck for you, hearing the clutter and Mama laughing at me when and not being a good cameraman sometimes. And not being a who? A good cameraman sometimes. Bye. I may mess up a bit. <laughs> uh, there you go. That's the Caleb household of the Silverwood Stitching and Rhino. Um, giving a shout out to uh, Gilbert on Hard Day's Night. He plays every day. Uh, he's playing for tips to keep his household and his family fed. If you, if you like the Beatles music. Uh, and oldies. Huh? And oldies. Oh, and oldies. He shows videos from back in the day. I'm talking like, uh, who's got the beef? How many people remember that? Where's the beef? Oh, where's the beef? Yeah. Whatever. What's that? It's, it's a commercial that used to be back on the day. Old Granny would come out and look at a burger and look at the camera and say, Where, where's the beef or something where's like that. Yeah. Joke. Got all kinds of old school video uh, commercials. And don't forget Cheers. And, yeah. Cheers. Uh, music. What? 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s. 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, and 90s okay. music. Um, takes requests if he can do them or if it's related to what he's doing and then like I said takes tips to uh, keep his family fed um, should I say anything else about him anything I'm not thinking of do you have anything on him um why is he not using the cheers intro anymore oh uh, because it's worried Facebook's getting pissy that you know so he doesn't want to use anything that's copyrighted that might get him in trouble oh uh, man that sucks Facebook what you doing, Taylor? No, every day, uh, 12, uh, 12 noon and 6.30 Pacific time. So every day at 12? And 6.30 Pacific and 6:30 time. And 6.30 Pacific time. And 11 a.m. for breakfast with the Beatles. On Sunday. On, On Sunday. Sunday is 11 a.m. for breakfast That's all Beatles. with the Beatles. Taylor, she's getting bigger. Yeah. Like I said, when I brought her home, she was about that big. Now she's this big. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Uh oh. Uh, 
uh, shirts. The only other project which I will actually make little clips for you. We got 32 shirts to make for a group. Uh, for, uh, starting that process, I have the first set of vinyls that we gotta weed and get ready. Those are going on. Now we all busy, busy with that all this week. We'll be making the vinyls, weeding them, and the next weekend I'll have to. Uh, next weekend I will have to. We'll start pressing the shirts. So I'll be standing in front of a heat press with 350 degrees. Yeah, but it's it's fun. And stressful. And stressful. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get it right. You gotta be perfect, right? All right. What else? Uh, so we'll creations on YouTube. Like it, share it, make comments, keep it up there for me. Give me suggestions. Give me feedback. Let me know what you think. Um, so we'll do some vinyl on Facebook. Share it, like it, share it to everybody you know, and then tell the people you like or know. I don't care if you don't like them. Doesn't matter to me. Just get the name out there. Get people to say, "I want one of those," or "That is awesome," or. Dang, he is so talented. I must have what he makes. I gotta have it. I gotta have it. I gotta go to Starbucks with my cup. Yeah, make that happen. First person that actually gets somebody referred, I give a 10% discount. Yeah? That'll work. There you go. 10% discount on your first cup. All they have to do is mention your name. Just got to say my name. No, the not, great. Not your name, the oh, person's my. name, so we know who to credit. Oh, they got to say the person's name. Yes. I saw it on whatever's Facebook page. You guys, you guys heard her. Yeah. I'll just, yeah. Just <laughs> whoever does that can get a discount. But they got to, but, you know, no, I want, I want something else. They got to say my name, too. They got to say he made an amazing cup that I got to have. There. Because I like it. I want to hear that. Well, fine. Then tell the people that you make cups for if they make a commercial, whatever you want to call it, a little Facebook thing about their cup, you'll give them 10% off their next cup. How's that? There you there go. 10%. I'm going to do like an Oprah Winfrey. You get 10%. You just get 10%. Everybody All right. gets my 10%. All right? Except for I'm not Oprah. I'm the me. Which is rich like Oprah. <laughs> Good side. <laughs> All right. Thank you, everybody. Uh, happy Sunday. God bless. Go forth in this new week. Um, I hope your family and you are blessed, and I hope you have good things come to you. Everybody stay healthy. Uh, watch the COVID-19 crap. Wash your hands. Wear your whatever, and don't touch people. If you touch them, make sure you touch them for a good reason. And have a good day. <laughs> Oh, you can't see her I'm off the camera, but she's not happy. <laughs> All right, let's just turn this off, okay?